everybody, Steve here. Just wanted to, Arlene and I went to the Zayed Cultural Heritage Festival 2021. Thought we shared some sight and sounds from the vent there coming in. It's the Emirates section there. Music going. Got to see a falcon up close. That was pretty, that was really cool. It's very cool, uh, beautiful birds, beautiful. And uh, this was kind of a light garden here they had out there. That's the central column in the middle of it. You can see that from miles away, but uh, all kind of LED lights. And then they had these all these lights scattered around. Beautiful. They had music going. That's why I got it muted. I don't know if it's like copyrighted or anything. So beautiful sights there. There's some more falcons. They put those leather hoods over them to keep them calm. Um, and they took it off for the picture. That was nice enough for them there. A lot of falconry is a big thing here. That's what's cool with these parasols hanging upside down. Yeah, you see falcon uh, falcon uh, races and everything else. They hunt and race, and they're real big here. So we're walking up. Each uh, uh, each Arab country is represented here. This is from uh, this is from Uzbekistan. So we're thinking, oh, they're putting on a little show here. Well, this turned into a parade. These guys were leading it. You can see some of those trumpet things. They're like trombones with no slides. Yeah, that's Uzbekistan. So they had the trumpet guys in front and the ladies dancing there. They had some guy, see the guy with the purple shirt on there? He's got food in that thing and he puts it on his head and shows everybody, I guess, advertising what they're serving over there. So the parade start. So we were like, hey, that's pretty cool. Let's follow along. And as we were walking along all the different countries, they had dancers and drummers and everything else that would kind of fall in the lines. So we kind of tagged along the back end of the parade there. I guess Arlene and I were representing America in the parade. America! <laughs> so we were dancing and singing, trying to keep up appearances. Well, maybe not. <laughs> so each country would kind of peel in with their different things. I'll show, there'll be a site a little bit later that we'll get the side view and see all of them as they go along. So dancing and drums and clacking wooden blocks and all kind of stuff. Some, I don't know what this country was. They didn't do a whole lot except walk along. You hear the clicking of blocks there. I think that was Bahrain, I think. Not sure what is up with the gold dudes. That was, I forget which country that was, Qatar or Oman with the gold dudes, I don't remember. I don't know what the significance of that is. So I'm recording over this, Arlene sitting here tapping her feet. She's got a catchy beat. So you can dance to it. <laughs> Stretch all the way down. They kind of walk. There was India was in there too, which was interesting. So it's a large uh, Muslim population there in India as well. There's a large everything in India. 1.3 billion people. They got a little bit of everything there. I think I come up on the side view here. So, so this was Uzbekistan. They were the best. They were great, weren't they? The dancers and the little. So if you want to look for a gift to give your young grandchildren, give them one of those little horns that the guys are playing. That would be great. Your neighbors will appreciate that. <laughs> it's like princesses or something now with the pointy hats and all. 
There's India. guys I'm not real sure what they are supposed to be but they're shiny this is some uh, Emirati traditional Emirati songs and dances and singing songs and telling stories through song and they stand around and sing and with their shepherds and sticks understood the words. This guy's frying up uh, kemat, which are like the fried donuts. I've shown those before in the Arab uh, food video I did, the Arab restaurant. So he's frying them up in the wok there, dropping them in. And then we got some camels. This is pretty cool. Look at the way they, they run there. That, check it out. So look at the way they run. So they run, so left and right legs go forward at the same time or, or the left side goes forward and then the right side front and back I should say about 40 miles an hour top speed but they can run for 25 miles an hour for an hour it's pretty cool but it gives so the left forward and aft leg go forward then the right uh, and they it gives them kind of a nice swaying motion so it's one of the reasons they call them the ships of the desert so they have that nice rocking back and forth motion like a like a boat or something, which is very cool. So they kind of br they're bringing these camels out, kind of stretching their legs, letting them run around a little bit. See how they're running? It's very cool. It's not like a horse. It's not like uh, they and they they uh, they kind of like cats, I guess. The cats are the same way. But uh, see how they rock back and forth? Really makes it a comfortable ride if you ever rode on a camel. I've never galloped on a camel, uh, but uh, sure it's comfortable. I'll take their word for it. Here they go. They were a little shy. They weren't, they wouldn't come right up to the, uh, to the fence or anything. They're kind of going, hey, uh, probably smell my cologne or something. No. So, this is just some, uh, some of the sights and sounds of the Zayed, uh, Cultural Heritage Festival they have every year, and this will run till April. But uh, sights and sound, there's kind of the entrance there. It's pretty cool. So I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a comment below, and uh, thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time on the next adventure. Mm -hmm.